Well, we're going to get the full schedule on the weather from Rob. <laughs> forecast for outdoor events is beautiful. I mean, no rain in the forecast. I know that's a big concern for any of the outdoor festivals and not just today or this weekend, but really for the long term, I don't see any appreciable rain in the forecast. And while that makes for great festival weather, it does not make this map look any better because this map has been getting worse and worse and worse. I think about four or five weeks ago, I started showing you this each weekend. And the reason why is because the pattern has not changed very much. So we're now up into the severe drought category. It's now spread over much of the area and rain does not look likely in the long term forecast. So, so far we've seen 0.88 inches of rain in June. There is no more rain in forecast in the seven day, at least looking out seven days and potentially beyond that. If we don't get any more rain, June 2023 will rank fifth driest uh, on record going back about 150 years worth of data. Some hope that maybe this will bring at least some rain to parts of the Midwest, likely not going to bring rain here. It's just too dry and that system will really just bring us a few clouds, but temperatures are starting in the 40s and 50s. There's a little bit of moisture in the atmosphere, enough that it's been causing some fog to develop. The lake is also helping to cool you down if those temperatures are a little bit too warm, so setting the drought aside for just a moment. It actually is a pretty nice forecast. High temperature near 80 degrees. I mean, this is beautiful June weather, a little bit cooler along the lakefront. For those of you that maybe don't enjoy those 80 degree temperatures, you're looking for a bit of a cool down and that east wind off of the lake isn't going to be terribly strong today. So while the waves may pick up just a little bit on the lakefront, they won't be uh, terribly dangerous out there. But as always, please exercise caution if you're going to be on Lake Michigan. Temperatures warming up very quickly today. Lots of sunshine, maybe a few high thin clouds developing as the day wears on overall beautiful Saturday. And then as we head into your Sunday, kind of the same thing. One minor change is not as much of a lake influence for tomorrow. There will be some lake influence, but more of a southeast wind as opposed to an east wind. And that system that tries to approach notice the rain showers to our west. They're just not able to overcome the dry air that's in place, so we'll make it even warmer than the 80s. I think we'll go to 85 at least for O'Hare uh, areas along the lakefront will be a little bit cooler, not just today, but also tomorrow and the long range forecast. Again, it looks beautiful on paper, but we certainly could use the rain. It's mid 80s most of next week, a lot of sunshine and partly cloudy skies by the time we get to Friday.